let's do this. Shit. So now things just got really, really intense. Um, so we we were at that point now where you know we were we realized 2012 now solo battles are coming up. Now we were individually testing ourselves whether we could do this or not. Now I was just in it for the fun. I didn't really care because I'm more of a crew guy. But Mikhail was determined this time that he wanted to you know win that solo championship for himself. He wanted to prove himself. And uh, Donald was the obstacle in his way. First round, we got the draws and uh, figured out it was Donald versus Mikhail. Um, Mikhail, I remember, was so determined to train and he was like, hey, I gotta win, I gotta win, I gotta win. And we were on Arts Council stage and he was like, am I doing this right? And I was like, yeah, you're doing this, do it properly. He was like, shut up, I think I know what I'm doing. And I'm like, no, you don't know what you're doing. Do it fucking properly. And I was pushing him to his level best. I was split in the middle between Donald and Mikhail, between Donald and Mikhail. But then at the end of the day, we're all dancers, we're all b-boys. And that's something that, you know, they had to just hash out themselves. Me and Donald always had a little bit of a... Ah, ah, what do you say? Rivalry is too strong of a word because we were in the same crew. We got along less, but uh, not... We were never like pissed off to the extent where we were going to, I guess, get into a hand-to-hand fight. Plus, plus, I, I'm a huge pacifist. I don't fight anyway. I probably would, Don would probably just whoop my ass and I'd let him. <laughs> so, uh, anyway, we got into this uh, tournament, we went into the battle. I went in t- telling Dwayne I probably will lose because uh, there was always a weird feeling of conspiracy. Okay, like uh, the judges are going to be one sided or I always felt, yeah, because like Donald was b boying longer, he, they knew him better and stuff. Basically, what had to happen at that point in time, what what happened there was supposed to be left there and not picked off from there. But that's something that it was a misfortune that it happened. But it was basically picked off and uh, it headed with us all the way back to our locker rooms in Sindhaja during our playtime. Uh, Avanti, I believe, was one of them. And uh, that's where the heat started to get a little bit more. We could feel it, uh, you know, rising every minute as we reached there. There came a point uh, when uh, Donald's mom was like, you know, he doesn't need to be part of this crew anymore because, I don't know, maybe she had a different perception on us that we were not trying to, you know, lift him up or maybe drag him down or something. I don't know, that's that's their thing. But that started to affect our crew because uh, if you think about it, he's been with us for a long time. So if you're going to pull someone away so fast from us, that's really going to impact something, right? You have a building put up and you're going to pull away one pillar that's going to crumble somewhere. I think that's where things just became bitter and sour because then we lost that motivation to train as a team and everybody just wanted to train individually. And I think the aftermath of that was just where things started to split up. Like, you know, there was no further picking. I mean, we never got into fights and all that. Thank God for that. But, you know, we could we could sense that resentment that came there and that didn't, didn't pan out so well. And, you know, it just made things very sour between all of us. You know, Donald was training with Brandon and I was training with Mikhail. Then when I would train with Mikhail, Brandon and I were the two neutral niggers in this entire thing. Like, we were just on both sides. But we sensed that there was a wall that got built between Mikhail and Donald that particular day. And, you know, that's when it really made an impact. That's what happened. That was the aftermath of the battle. Things kind of soured between uh, Donald and the, and the, I wouldn't say the three of us, but between Donald and the relationship of dance, b-boying specifically. Like... His relationship with B-Boy took a hit. He came back with the wild card. He didn't make it through the wild card either. So either his confidence or his, or his relationship with dancing, with B-Boy, break dancing especially, took a hit there. Yeah, it definitely did. Mm-hmm.